kiss for you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development and so guys in this video I am going to give you a, a short demo of my new app and that is the random audio calling using Firebase and WebRTC in Android Studio. Alright so in this video I will be explaining you the features of my app and here you can see I have this project which is ready and I already have uh, uploaded and published it to the Google Play Store. So I will upload the link in my video des description so you can go there and install and you can uh, uh, you can also test it and also uh, so now uh, I have connected my both devices and I want to show you the demo first of all. So here I al already have opened the Firebase. So there you can see we have the database which is empty and for the authentication part we I have used the anonymous. So the users will be anonymously signed in uh, using the Firebase uh, authentication. So we don't need to have the email ID or password or any other thing but I am planning to add it in uh, in my other or the next version. Alright so there you can see we have this Firebase authentication which is empty and also we have the, the database which is empty and here you have you can see I have this uh, Android project with uh, with the Facebook ads. So here we have the interstitial ad and I have implemented the native ads. Alright so now what I want to show you is that here you can see I already have connected my both devices this is Samsung Galaxy C7 and here I have the Samsung Galaxy A30. Alright so first of all let me uh, I think I have I haven't installed the app so from there if we search about the Harun Studios and from there we can easily find our app so I think from here and yes we have this dev voice calling and we have to install it in the meanwhile i show you what our activities are like we have only three activities so so first of all uh, a splash screen will be opened and then the main activity will be opened so let me show you the main activity and here we have the main activity and there we will have the uh, we have the toolbar which I haven't shown and there we have this to get quick connection use it around 2 p.m. and here we have the call button so when the, the user will click on on this button then he will be in the searching mode okay so uh, so suppose if we have uh, we suppose if we have 10 users which are in the searching mode so it will the system will uh, randomly select any two of these uh, users and connect with each other and they can talk with as many minutes as they can as they want all right so i think now our application has been installed so here we will op we will open the app and also we open the app in our other phone let me open and we have to make sure that we have to allow it and here you can see we have the facebook uh, interstitial ads and there you can also see we have to allow the user permission and from there we have to close it and there you can see we have the native uh, Facebook ad here and there you can also see the interstitial ad which is showing and the here you can see we have only this button call and we have rate us and contact us okay so suppose if I want to press this so there you can see searching and if I show you the firebase so there you can see we have these two users and we have the searching so we have one user which is now searching and if I reload it so you there you can see we have the anonymous users all right and suppose if I also want to start searching and there you can see and yes you can see now the both uh, the users are now connected and they can talk with each other and there you can see you, uh, you you may hear my voice so that's how it works then we have these two buttons we have the two uh, the button of mute so if we want to mute the user so we can press it and there you can see it is now mute and also we have the speaker button and non speaker button and we have the end and call button and there you can see i have this facebook native ad and here it is showing the call duration so if i press end call so there you can see now the call has been 
and date and here we will see inside our database so now the searching node has been deleted all right so that's how it works so if i press it again it is now searching and if i press it it and now both are uh, in the searching mode and now both are connected using the web rtc so there it is the web rtc you can see these are all the classes that i have used app rtc so that's how it works and i have the facebook ads here which are integrated so guys if you want the source code so i will upload my or put my link in the video description so you can go and first of all install the app and uh, and test it yourself and if you want the source code you so you have to just message me on my facebook so i will reply to your query so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you and goodbye